Russell Sage College has developed a new program for aspiring educators. Leaders hope that it'll help address staffing shortages and close the gap in programming left by the closure of St. Rose. News 10 ABC's Juliana Bruno has the details. Russell Sage College signed an agreement this morning that will help fill a void left by the impending closure of the College of St. Rose, a program for students going into the education field. St. Rose and Russell Sage both have been strong educational leaders over the years. The administration at Russell Sage wants to make sure that momentum continues. A new instructional leadership advanced certificate program will be delivered online through Russell Sage that meets state requirements for those wishing to become principals and superintendents. Right now there's just not a robust backbench in many districts for quality leaders. So that's what we're trying to solve. Dr. Deborah Shea, the program coordinator, came over from the College of St. Rose and developed this program with Dr. Francesca Durand, chair of the Educational Leadership Department at Russell Sage. It really helps us make that transition from um, the classroom to leadership spaces, and it can mean anything from being an instructional leader, a teacher leader, all the way to an assistant principal, principal, and then working at the district level. In addition to offering this online program to students throughout the capital region and New York State, Russell Sage signed a contract with the Center for Integrated Training and Education, or SITE, down in New York City, a partnership previously held by the College of St. Rose. Between local students and the SITE partnership, St. Rose granted 1,139 educational leadership certificates in 2021 to 2022, according to the National Center for Education Statistics. We're just so pleased to be able to take that over and allow those students that may not have completed to complete and then for the new students to be able to do that. Russell Sage is now enrolling students for both a late spring and fall semester start and is working with St. Rose to add the program to their teach out agreement, which is still being finalized. Reporting in Troy, Juliana Bruno, News 10 ABC.